hello, hello. Hello, teacher. Hello, Walter. How are you? Oh, teacher, I'm fine. And everything's fine, teacher. That's excellent. That's excellent. Ready for the yes, class? Teacher, and yesterday. Yes, you have problems with I the internet. Many inconvenient uh, inconvenient problems. Internet. Uh, yes, problem. Okay. Problem. Yeah. And you, uh, you know when, show, yeah, uh, you know what you can do whenever you start having problems with the connection. Uh, uh, turn off the camera for a little while. Cuando no escuche bien o tenga problemas de conexión o el ancho de banda sea muy bajo, desactive la cámara un momento. Ah, ok, teacher. Thank you. Thank you. Because And back to the teacher. I come in with our energy always. <laughs> oh, well, that's good. Cool. That's good. Cool. And tell me, what's the plan for the weekend? What you gonna do? Are you playing this weekend? Ah, yes. Yes. Uh, we are planning uh, as family uh, and to go see the movie to the cinema. Oh, that's oh, cool. Visit the, oh, 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 visit the, oh, visit a park or another option. It goes at a restaurant. Okay, and which uh, movie are you going to watch? Uh, uh, oh, my God. Todavía no sabemos, todavía no sabemos. <laughs> eh, 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 and if you can, then spend uh, at home watching a movie in my house. <laughs> in my house good. or in my cine. Yes. Uh, That's I good. That's cool. Girl and... yeah. Yes, teacher. Yeah. And, and, and we'll see do now do now is correct yes no sabemos todavía. we don't know uh, yet we don't know yet uh, we don't know. let me text it for uh, you it will be like this uh, what also i will take in picture okay. no and we yet. also uh, how to the shopping hmm. and that's good weekend. That's good. That's yes. good. It's... And this day, and this day, this day, and we had gone into the supermarket. I also put my hair. Oh, you got a haircut? You say it like yes. this. Repeat after me. Repeat after me. I got a okay. haircut. I got a haircut. A haircut. A haircut. I got a haircut. Yes. I got a haircut. That's cool. Do you uh, like it short? Yes. Yes. Yeah. In the, my the case, uh, mine is very long. <laughs> oh my yeah. God! You're not. My mine actually. I cannot. Is, I cannot. Mine is like this long. Look. It's like this. Okay, okay. Uh, in my case, my, my loot is a uh, hero. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know. Well, Walter, nice talking to you. Welcome to the class. The welcome, teacher. Thank you. By the way, guys, let me text everybody because it's time. Okay, let's see who else is around. Lucero, hello, how are you? Lucero, hello. Hi, couldn't be better and you? Well, you know, here. Working as usual, and tell me how's everything? How was your day? 
Uh, my day was interesting um, because I, I woke up at 5 a.m. And also I, I got up um, happy and I, and I did my, my household chore. Um, and finally, I, I was starting um, the course today. That's excellent. So that means that you were pretty busy today. You were very busy today, you said. Okay. Let's see, let's see. And tell me, what's the plan for the weekend? What you gonna do tomorrow, Lucero? Okay, um, for the weekend, I I will think to to live at, at the sea because I live uh, near from from the beach, and I would like to to walk in the seashore. And I would like to, to ride on my bike. Oh, really? You like biking? Yes. That's quite interesting. And tell me, what's your favorite place to go biking? Uh, to me, my favorite place to biking is, is the mountain. Yes. Yes, it's my favorite because um, I consider myself with with risky, um, and I like the um, how do you say the zonas altas or the subidas? High, the high areas. The high areas. I prefer the risky oh. adventure. Okay, well, that's good. That's actually good. Excellent. Well, thank you very much, Lucero, and welcome to the class. Thank you. Let's see who else is around. Who else is around? Let's see. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Just give me a second, Daniel is texting me. Okay. Let's see, let's see. Marta, hello, Marta. Hi, teacher, good evening. Good evening, Marta. Tell me that you are doing something different this weekend besides going shopping and sleeping in the afternoon. Uh, the same story, teacher. Do you know? <laughs> Maybe, do you not remember the, I will go to breakfast with my, oh, with yeah. my friends, I remember. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Actually, I, I noticed that uh, you got meetings with your friends quite regularly, right? Yes. The other every day, week. I remember you every went week. to the beach. Oh, by the way, you told me you went to the, you were going to go to the beach last weekend, right? Yes, yes, of course. How, how was it? Tell me the story, please. Well, uh, everything was okay, teacher. I, I, the trip is fine. Uh, in the food is very good. I eat a lot. I ate. Ate, sorry. I ate a lot, but this week I, how do you say, dieta teacher? Oh, I'm on a diet. Uh, yes, this week for, do you know, report, I no sé, responder lo que. Yeah, I can imagine. I can imagine. Yes, Actually, teacher, what you are going to do, what you are going to do is this: you are going to get rid of the excess, right? Okay. <laughs> yes, but 
all is wonderful, right? And very good. Excellent. That's nice. Glad to hear it. Yes, teacher. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see, let's see. Who else is around? Thank you very much, Marta. Thank you, teacher. Susanna, hello. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Hi, fam. Okay, Susanna, and tell me how was your day? And today I I um, work it. Work oh, really? It. I I worked. I worked um, with my my responsibility. <laughs> um, um, and to to I to I I cook. Oh really? I cook it. Well, I lunch. I lunch my family. Uh, it's a specific uh, my father I and my son. Okay. In that, in this case, the proper way will be like this. I also prepared lunch. Okay. For my family. Okay. I also prepare lunch for my family. Oh, that also, means that you were busy. Um, visit. Um, okay. No. <laughs> well, thank you very much, Susanna, and welcome to the class. Okay, thank you, teacher. Let's see, Claudia. Hello, Claudia. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. <laughs> How are you? Tell me, Claudia, where are you going this weekend? Every weekend you go somewhere different. Uh, tomorrow, uh, in the morning, I grab plate and I, wa I will wash uh, the uniform. And in the afternoon, I will go to the, the church. I will there go are... to church, to church. Okay, I will go to church and there are a meeting, meeting with children. Oh, nice. Yes, yeah, see, after that, um, I explain, I explain the, the, the fraction, to a child. Okay. Yes. So you're you're going to teach math as usual. Yes, teacher. Well, that's cool. That's cool. I yes, for, for and children, Sunday? I don't have plan. But really? my, um is um my sister's birthday. Oh, that's nice to hear. Yes. That's cool. So you're going to have fun with your family. Yes, teacher. That's nice. Excellent. Glad to hear it. Thank you very much, Claudia, and welcome. Thank you, teacher. Mm, let's see. Let's see. Ambar. Hello, Ambar. How are you doing? <clears throat> Hello, teacher. I'm fine. What about you? I'm just fine and tell me how you're doing of your throat, the flu. Uh, I'm doing better? Feel better. Uh, I'm feeling better. But still, I can hear still like a little bit of trouble. Yes, yeah, a, a little. How do you say? Estoy un poco ronca. <clears throat> well, uh, I got, I got, uh, Boys, mm, I got a rough I got boys. A rough boys. Uh, rough, rough, rough. It's like a sounds F, 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 right? Yes, exactly. Rough. Okay. Oh my gosh! Yeah, yeah. I can hear you pretty strong. 
Yes, uh, it's, it's my voice. Very, very rough. <laughs> yeah, I actually, Amber, uh, you have a little bit of a deep voice, right? I mean, deep. your normal yes. voice is a little bit deep, deep. Yes, yes, my voice is really deep because it's, it's, it's like a, it's the family. Oh, really? Oh, you say it like this, that expression, that expression, uh, what you just said, is the familia? You say it like this, look, it runs in the family. You say it like this, it runs in the family. It runs in the family. My mom is, she, she she's has, got, she's got, she's got a uh, deep voice to my my brother, well, it's obvious. Well, it's, I, I imagine uh, that your brother must have a beautiful voice. Yes, yes, it's very, very deep. Um, I have a, how do you say, Tia? Aunt. My aunt is, she, she have a deep voice too. Oh, it's really? like me, yes. Oh. That's interesting, that's interesting. Actually, well, in a lady, it's kind of, uh, of attractive to find a lady with a big voice. That's nice, quite interesting. Ambar, thank you very much and welcome to the class. Thank you, teacher. See you. Let's see. Man, I got Nicolas and Walter with uniform. Both got a short hair. Hello, Nicolas. How are you? Hello, teacher. How are you? I'm just fine. Just fine. Tell me, what's the plan for Sunday? What you gonna do? Uh, for the Sunday, well, mm, I don't know. Uh, for the moment, ah, yes, yes. Uh, for the Sunday, I, I will, I will travel. Already, with, where to? With with my wife and um, her and uh, her friend, a uh, her her yes her friend. Uh, I I I I will the driver for my wife. <laughs> okay, where are you going? Mm, I think uh, to a Panica city. Uh, the flower root. Oh, really? That's yes. nice. But I you're don't going know. to be the driver. Yes, only. Hey, you, Nicolas, you yeah, are my driver on Sunday. No, yeah, no. I know what, yes. I know what that's like. I know, I know. I got you. I got you, man. <laughs> I understand you perfectly. <laughs> well, well, um, well, and. Um, and, and entonces, but <clears throat> how then, do you say entonces? Then, <clears throat> then, um, then uh, we'll eat probably, probably, probably eating, probably, probably, uh, uh, we'll eat, we'll eat uh, beef or or typical foods of typical. the typical foods of the, the place of the place okay that's nice so you mm. got a good plan on monday nicolas i'm going to ask you about your trip okay sorry on monday i will ask you about your trip so remember everything about the trip because on monday i'm going to ask you Ah, uh, really? Yes, I am. <laughs> Thank you, Nicolas. Okay, Welcome okay, to the class. Teacher. Thank you. Good evening, everybody. Thank you. Thank you. Let's see. Hey, Fernando. Oh, that's cool, Fernando. You are early tonight. That's excellent. <laughs> Hi, teacher. It's a miracle, right? So, uh, yeah, well, actually, it's a Friday. Supposedly, if I'm not mistaken, Fridays are like, in theory, 
they are short days for you, right? In theory, right? <laughs> theoretically, theoretically. Theoretical. Or in theory, you can use either one. In theory. In theory, oh. in theory. In theory, okay. So, yes. uh, what time did you finish working today? Today around 3 p.m. Okay, well, not that late. So you have, have time to relax a little bit, right? Yeah, I, I went with my children to, to, to eat because today is mm -hmm. Children's Day. Oh, really? Oh, yeah, sure. I'm a teacher, yes. Today is Children's <laughs> Day. I know, yeah. I know. So, my, so my you have fun I... with them. Sorry? My wife and I took them. Uh, uh, my wife and I to, uh, les llevamos to took them, took them, uh -huh. took them to to eat and to buy uh, some toys. Cool, that's <laughs> nice. Yeah. It's very nice that you have Keep the it. opportunity to to have fun with your kids. What do you have for lunch? Uh. No, no, no for, lunch, for, for dinner. No, for dinner. What did you have for dinner? Uh, they chose pizza. Pizza. They, oh, yeah. they chose pizza. The children love pizza. So they choose Thank you. Pizza. I love pizza. So I'm a children too. Yeah, I love pizza. <laughs> I really yeah. love it. And after then, we, we, went to, we went to Dollar City because the taste are cheaper. Oh, man. <laughs> yes, but going to Dollar City, it's so bad, so bad. I get afraid anytime they ask me like, hey, let's go to Dollar City. I get like, oh, no, man, it's <laughs> going to be terrible. I end up spending a lot of money in there. You just know what, what do you want? Dollar City is say what do you want? Yeah, well, <laughs> actually, that happens with hair. In my case, I got the problem. I got the same problem if I go to to the to the to Preun. Epa, Preun, or B3. Man, <laughs> I get crazy there. That's yeah. why I avoid it. I try not to go on payday. If I go on paydays, oh, that's terrible. That's terrible. You know, accomplish that the the budget. No, man, that's terrible. I get excited. Like right now, I am trying to buy a, a, a welder. A right welder. now, I am thinking to buy a welder. Perhaps at the end of the month, if I do a small business, I will buy me a welder. Do welder. you know what is a welder? No. no Actually, I want a welder, but a special one. I want an inverter. Un soldador. Inverter. Oh, okay. But I want... The welder that I want is an inverter. Oh, okay, I got it. No. Yeah, I wanna, I wanna try them. I have actually, I have never, I have never welded with those, and I'm curious. So I'm planning on buying one. Hmm. You know, to do little things at home, and it's going to be fun to practice. But the only bad problem is that if I buy one of those, I mean, they're going to ask me to do a lot of stuff here. <laughs> you have to, to take advantage of, of it. Yeah, yeah. Well, Fernando, welcome to the class. Thank you very much. Okay, thanks to you. Okay, guys, before I continue, let me please get the attendance. So let's get it fast. Ambarelli Alfaro Gomez. Present. Thank you. Claudia Elizabeth Ramos Barrientos. Present. Thank you. Daniel Eduardo Segura Valencia. Is here. Fernando Marvin Gonzalez Martinez. Present. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejia. Present, teacher. Jose Ernesto Osorio Morán. Present, teacher. Lucero Abigail Rodríguez López. Present, teacher. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Marta Ana Belinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Natanael Ayala Arizondo. 
Present teacher. Thank you. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Present, present. Thank you. Oscar Ricardo Alvarenga Rodríguez. Roxana Iveda Asensio de Mejía. Silvia Elizabeth Avendaño Pineda. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present teacher. Uh, Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present teacher. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. Present teacher. Yanira Elizabeth Asensio García. Present teacher. Thank you. I don't know why, Yanira. Whenever I say your last name, I don't know why I always think de. I'm so sorry. I wonder why. It's weird. Yeah, Hello, but Janina. we need to we yes, need to me, check. We need to check the we need the image. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm crazy with that. You know, I'm really I'm seriously thinking about getting the hammer. Yeah. Actually, actually, that's the machine I am using right now. Really? Yeah. And video? I'm working on it. What? The and video is. I'm sorry. And video? This... Is, well, is, no. is, is work or no? It's working. I mean, oh, what, nice. doesn't, what doesn't open is the, the camera on the app on Windows, but on Windows doesn't open. In Zoom, the camera opens normal. Okay. So, so and it's... what happened with the store? No, it doesn't open. I tried so many different ways. I'm thinking about killing it. Well, <laughs> perhaps. No, teacher, I... we need to check the, the event viewer. We'll do, we'll do it. But for the moment it's working, so let's relax a little okay. bit. If not, I got the other one right there ready to start it. I have the other <laughs> because the other like computer ready. is more slow. Yeah, it's slower. Remember, Jenny, oh, it's oh, slower. Nice. Yeah, actually, you know, it's, it's funny. slower. Okay, okay. It's funny, slower. you know. I got Right now I got, let's see, one, two, three, I got four laptops and this desktop. And I got another laptop that I need to repair it. I need to change the, the, the hard drive. And that one is the one that I love. I will fix it up. But the other ones, the problem is that they are pretty slow. And I mean, they are not old, but they are pretty slow. So this is the one that works faster for me. Is this so, golf working? Yeah, yeah, to, yeah to be working on a slow it. machines is terrible. Yes, you need passion. Yeah, you, you need, need to, to be get pretty. Passion. You need to be pretty, <laughs> pretty patient. I know. Well, Janita, and tell me what's the plan for the weekend? What you gonna do? Well. Maybe I I go to the bank because I need to. Um, Good luck. <laughs> thank you, teacher. I need to uh, refrendar. Yes. Uh, the circulation. Oh, the car. Yeah. yeah. I did it, uh, I did it on, let's see, on Tuesday. I did it on Tuesday. And you know what's funny? I, I did it on Tuesday for one car and this week I have to do it for the other car. So, oh. Yes, I, I got that. I got, I, I, I went to the last week for my car and tomorrow uh, my father's car. It's terrible, it's so terrible. And I mean, it's, yeah. it's money. Yes, I know. And I need to go to the, I, maybe I, I go to the supermarket. And that's it, teacher. That's it? That's all? Yeah. Well, 
Re That's cool. Really, I, I don't have plan for the weekend. Well, for try to weekend. rest. Try to rest. It's very important to rest. Yes, because you know, is end. Well, not really end of month because it's beginning of month, but I <laughs> I stay in end of month. I need to to sew a lot of stuff. I can imagine. Well, thank you very much, and then welcome to the class. Roxana, you, you know, teacher Roxana. Oh, this. Ah, yeah, I can imagine. Well, <laughs> she's not even here tonight. She hasn't appeared really? in classes. Yeah, no, she's not. Oh, Jesus. Maybe she's yeah. working. Perhaps the same happened with uh, with uh, 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 Maria Alejandra, not here either. Oh, this is interesting. Yeah, uh -huh. quite interesting, actually. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's see. Well, thank you very much and welcome. Thank you, teacher. Mr. Osorio, hello, how are you? Hello, teacher. I'm fine, teacher, at the moment. Okay, tell me, what's the plan for the weekend? Do you have anything special, something to share? Uh, I think uh, tomorrow uh, I have to work all day in overtime. Uh, mm -hmm. Yes, teacher. That is usual. I work on Saturdays. And later in the afternoon, I will go to buy something for my daughters. Uh, possibly, uh, we will have dinner outside. And oh, on Sundays, nice. on Sundays is the day to, to get up late and have, a, deli nice. have a delicious breakfast. Uh, and cook something delicious to lunch and for lunch for lunch for lunch for lunch and maybe Tell me, what what do you like cooking for lunch for lunch uh, i i help um, my wife teacher uh, oh, okay. generally it's it's something meat to uh, a grill Okay, usually, usually, usually. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Yes, teacher. Good. Oh, those are nice plans. Thank you very much, Mister, and welcome. Thank you, teacher. Francisco, hello, Francisco. How are you? It's fine, teacher. Oh, more hard. <laughs> At work? Yes, teacher. <laughs> so you're gonna finish tonight at what time? 10? Uh, yes, teacher, 10 o'clock. And tomorrow is your day off? No, teacher. Uh, uh, in this shift, uh, I am uh, this shift on Thursday, Thursday teacher. Ooh. And tomorrow you got again night shift or you go early in the morning? Not too sure. Uh, afternoon shift. Afternoon. It's possible. Uh, it's possible. Uh, I I uh, I change shift with a coworker, and oh. I start uh, the shift uh, in the morning at six. Ouch! All day, teacher. All day. And oh, you're gonna so, stay all day? It's possible, teacher. It's possible. That's but terrible. In, in, in Sunday, going to cover uh, for you. Excuse me, teacher. You're going to cover for him tomorrow, and on Sunday, he's covering for you. Yes, yes, teacher. Yes, that's cool. Well, in a way, it's good. I mean, you got Sunday. Completely for resting. Yes, teacher. <laughs> but tomorrow it's hell because it's pretty heavy. Yes. Uh, in this uh, in this moment uh, in in my work uh, we are many uh, maintenance activity. 
There are. There are. Uh, excuse me, teacher. There are. Yes, there are many uh, maintenance activities. Maintenance. Maintenance. Maintenance activity. And okay. uh, um, then, uh, teacher, how, how do you say uh, in this form, the day passes rapidly? Okay, that way, actually, you say like this that way, that way, the day goes fast. Okay, oh, okay. So, sure. <laughs> that way, the day. I think you're very busy, Francisco. We'll talk later. Don't worry. Don't worry. Let's see. Who else do I have here? Sylvia. Hello, Sylvia. How are you? Hello, teacher. I'm good. What about you? Well, I'm fine. You know, same old story as usual. And tell me. Well, no, I want to ask you about the plan because as as far as I remember, you work weekends, right? Yes. Okay, tell me, which shift you got tomorrow? I, I am vacation from tomorrow. Oh, yeah. You're, you start vacations tomorrow, right? I start vacations tomorrow, yes. Two weeks. I will... I will get to work again on six, 16, August is 16, for and two weeks, uh, yeah. October 16. October That's 16. cool. Yeah. That's cool. I mean, two whole weeks of vacations. That's nice. Well. That's really nice. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you got time for resting doing your own things it's good it's yeah. good do you have any special plans for vacation no uh, maybe i will go to visit my best friend um uh, i will go to the beach in the evening okay where does your best friend live uh she lives in el Mahawat. okay cool yeah <laughs> oh come on you will go from the beach to the beach Yes. Okay, yes. cool. Sometimes we go to her house and we, we cook, we took a lot of pictures, we take a lot of pictures and then we go to the beach in the afternoon. That's our usual plan when I go to her house. Okay, do you plan to stay over or just to go visit? No, just to go visit. Just for one day okay. and then I come home again. That's nice, that's nice. So you're going to rest, you're going to enjoy your time. Excellent. Yes. I hope you have fun. Yes, yeah, thank you. you Welcome, Sylvia. Thanks to you. Thank you. Nathanael, hello, how are you? Hi, teacher. How are you? I'm just fine, just fine. What about you? I'm fine, I'm fine. It's, it's, it's Friday. Well, yeah. Yeah. It's Friday, but we're in class, so yeah. At least you expect to rest tomorrow. And tell me, do you work weekends? Uh, I I don't work. I don't work on weekends, so it's it's my last name, the last light day, last day, uh, to work. So it's oh, that's nice. On weekend, no, no, you no. I usually work on weekend, but it's it's uh um. It's not always. Yeah. Okay. And what do you do? Um, I work in auditors in some companies. Oh, auditing. Yeah. That's nice. Quite interesting. So yeah. you're good at numbers. Probably. <laughs> you're good at numbers. Oh, man. That is... Yeah. I, I like the uh, mathematics thing. When, when I, I, I was uh, young, I like mathematics is my favorite, uh, my favorite um, uh, subject. Subject, yes. Okay, you tell you told me when I was young. How old are you, Mister? 
I, I am very old. <laughs> Try me. Oh, um, I am 40. Come on, I'm older than you. Okay. <laughs> okay. So that's not a big deal right here. And tell me, do you okay. have any special plan for the weekend? Uh, probably um, I will go to supermarket uh, tomorrow, probably. And, okay. and visit uh, um, some family and they live in, in, in our Japan. So probably it's my mini vacation for, from weekend and it's different um, from the city. So it's, it's more relaxed from, from. Yeah, I can imagine, I can imagine. Interesting. Yeah. Interesting, Thanks. interesting. Do you live in San Salvador? Yes, yes. Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah, to go to our Japan from San Salvador, you change the environment, you feel quite different. Yeah, the different, uh, uh, the sound of the, the car, so. Yeah, you can, you can unwind a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> That's cool. That's cool. Excellent. What it's like minimum vacation of, of well, yes. Thing um, from the from the weekend. <laughs> cool, cool. Welcome to the class, Mister. Thanks, thanks. No, thanks to you. Let's see. Where's Wilfredo? Wilfredo, hello. How are you? Hi, teacher. How's everything? How are you? I'm just fine, just fine. You know, same old story as usual. What about you? Very well, because today is Friday. Oh, tomorrow, cool. Tomorrow That's the attitude. Yes, yes, sir, teacher. So what's the plan for the weekend? Is there anything new or anything interesting? Mm, yes, yes, sir. Because um, from Sunday, I am going to go to play soccer with my son. We are going to oh, play cool. the same thing. Oh, really? Yes. You're going to be yes, playing sir. together? Okay, what's your position? Yes. Um, defender. Defender. Nice. Yes, I was sir. a defender too. Which side? Right oh, or really? left? Hey, right to hear that teacher. But yeah. that's, what was your position? Right or left? Um, my son play. Um, how do you say? Lateral. Uh, lateral, but which? Is he right or left? Derecho yes. or izquierdo? It is. Uh, both. Both. Both? That's yeah. cool. Like me? That's cool. I learned, I learned to play left or right or central. Okay. In my case, I was, let's see, I was right and I was also the last one. Uh -huh. Okay. But whenever I was the last one, I usually used to get a card, a yellow really? card or a red card. Oh, <laughs> yeah, you was very drawn to, to, to mark card. Hey, teacher, yeah. uh, playing soccer, I, I, <laughs> I need to learn some vocabulary to... Yeah, uh, that's normal, that's normal. I mean, it's not a uh, vocabulary that we usually use. No, in my case, you know, I used to like playing on the right because I was, when I was young at that long ago, I used to, I used to run fast. Really? Yeah, I used to run fast. And I mean, I used to run like, I could go all the way front and come back all the way fast and no problem for me. You go and come back very fast. Yeah. The thing is this, I used to play basketball also. Ah. Uh... Okay. And actually, I was better at playing basketball than at playing soccer. I played basketball for three years. I remember when I was starting in high school. Oh, really? But nice. yes, but I prefer to practice football and football, soccer, and, and, and karate. Oh, it's cool. to both, both the sports. Um, it was my my favorite. They were they were they my were favorites. My favorite sport. But okay, then, no, in my I, in my case, my favorite ones were uh, in this order. My favorites were 
basketball, volleyball, and soccer. I also used to play badminton, but just like for two years. I played badminton just for two years. So for me, basketball and volleyball were the first. Soccer was just for kids. I mean, it was not that I was that interested in it. I mean, I used to play it, but it was not my thing. Ah, okay. But in my case, teacher, I was, when I, I was, um, I remember 15 years, only I, I it, it, it was only my, my favorite sport, but then uh, I, I can play with my sons, my children. Yes, it is very good because the, the last Sunday teacher, I went to play soccer with um, near to Takachico. Do you know? I was living in Takachico for like six months. Really? But yeah. I, I grew up in near to Tacachico Resbaladero. I know there. Really? But I, I, went... I was living in Tacachico and I used to work in Las Arenas. Really? Hey, I grew up near near that. Oh, really? Yes, I grew sir. up. I grew. I, I grew. I'm sorry? I grew. grew. I grew up. Ah, in the past. Yeah, I grew yes. up. I grew up. Oh, really? Yes, but my friend, uh, I have some friends, their teacher, and they called me and they told me, hey, you want to play soccer with us? Yes, but I am going to go with my sons. They want to play with, with us. Oh, yeah. but Takachico, man, that place is so hot. Uh, yes, uh, the year is very hard yeah. to play in the weather. Yeah. To play and, and the weather I mean, is very hot, teacher. Yeah, I, it's a hot, pretty hot place. I mean, I was living there. I remember in winter, I remember sleeping on a hammock on the patio, almost like just in shorts and men <laughs> sweating, sweating, terrible. I guess that, teacher. Yes. Yeah, I, I actually, you know, I used to go by, I used to ride a bicycle from Takachico, from the town, to, to Las Arenas every day, go yes. back and forth because I was working there. I was teaching at a school. Actually, was uh, I teach in that school, let me see which year, 2003 or 2004, one of those two years. Um, it was a long while ago. I was young, pretty young. Yes. Oh, but nice it talking is, to you, Wilfredo. Uh, yes. Welcome, teacher. Welcome. I'm sorry, Wilfredo, but we get excited. I mean, talking about us back in the days. <laughs> Don't worry, teacher. Uh, okay, thank you. Let's see. Roxana, hello. Hello, good evening. Good evening. Are you smiling with me or are you laughing at me? Tell me. <laughs> Just here, teacher. <laughs> uh -huh. Hello, Roxana. How are you? How's everything? Mm, everything was okay. It was a busy day today. Okay. A long day. I finished work around 6 p.m. Okay, cool. But I think that tomorrow it will be better. Okay, and tomorrow, what's your schedule? Will you finish early? Mm, I guess, I hope so. <laughs> you hope so? What, My... Okay, what do you mean when you finish by saying that you finish early on Saturday? What time? I used to finish my work around 12. Okay. But my schedule is from 7 a.m. to 11. Okay. But right now I am um, I'm checking a lot of a lot of reports because uh, I have my closing now. Okay. And for Monday my uh, boss uh, need to have the closing. Quiere el cierre. Okay. He wants the closing done. 
Yeah, he, he she wants the clothes. He wants clothes. or he needs? He wants. <laughs> I think that okay. she wants. But uh, the thing is that I have a um, few days for prepare all the... For preparing? All the preparing. For preparing. For preparing uh, the closing. Okay. But uh, I think that it's okay. My time is okay, I think so. And maybe tomorrow I will finish my work at 11. Okay. I hope so. Excellent, excellent. excellent. That's so, nice. Yeah, the weekend it was very tight. So I need to take a rest and doing my thing. My son uh, get the vaccine on Sunday at the morning. Ooh. Yeah, my my mother and my father too. And I need to go with my son. So I have to do any ev anything. No, I no, everything, everything everything that I um that I want tomorrow because on Sunday I didn't, I, no, I want, I want, I want to uh, have uh, my free day okay. like the other week. I know. So, I know, I know. Well, don't worry, Roxanne. I mean, take it easy. Look at this. Let's see. Tomorrow I'm going to be, I need to take my, my mother-in-law to the doctor, then my mother-in-law and my father-in-law for the vaccine, then in the afternoon I got a meeting, then at night I'm going to prepare some material. Sundays, I, in the morning I need to work on some stuff around the house. In the afternoon I'm going to teach a class. I need to go to Santa Tecla to teach a class. And I live in San Martin, so I, and I'm going to be teaching that yeah. class at 3 p.m. Also tomorrow, oh, by the way, tomorrow I need to prepare a schedule for two students that I have that usually I teach them Saturday mornings, but for one month, they are not going to have the class face-to-face. -face. We are going to be working online. So take it easy, Roxana. You don't have a busy weekend. Don't worry. We just take a rest. Yeah, when I die, don't worry about no, it. No, teacher. <laughs> so, I think that you need to take a rest because it's very uh, difficult to start uh, the new week like that. Well, the thing is this. Usually, December, I don't work. Okay, yeah. Usually December, I don't I don't work because some of my students and that's my extra income, uh, like these courses. Usually in December we don't have classes, mm -hmm. and my students, let's see, uh, two of them they go to the states and the other one is going to Europe. So December for me is like not working. Easy. <laughs> No, no easy, no working, no extra working, no extra income. It's no good. What do you usually doing? In December. In December? Well, try to keep busy, have, fix everything in my house, at my sister's house, my in-laws house. Keep busy. Keep <laughs> you busy. love that. Yeah, I get <laughs> desperate. You know, the last days of vacations, I get insomnia. Because I'm so stressed of being home, but I get in Sunday. Yeah. Well, Roxana, welcome. Thank you. Thank you, teacher. Mr. William. Hello, William. You've been very quiet today. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you? Very well. Thank you. Oh, I'm just fine. Just fine. And tell me, William, what is the plan for the weekend? Uh, uh, Saturday, uh, work all day. Uh, and I uh, dinner so close with my family. Uh, yeah. uh, that's dinner. bad, that's bad. <laughs> uh, Sunday, 
we walk with my family and my pets in, in the morning. Okay, that's uh, nice. So you're uh, going to stay with your family and have fun with them? Yes, and make a night. Dream Dream so teacher the West or Bon? Bon? Oh, beef soup. Beef soup. Uh, with you with my parents. That's, I mean, you're telling me, you're telling me many things that I don't like. You're going to have pupusas for dinner. I hate pupusas. Then you're going to have beef soup. Man, that's terrible. That's unacceptable for me. Very delicious, Oh, no. Uh, uh, Sunday afternoon, uh, uh, eating mix. Oh, really? Yes. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, Wilfredo este, Takashiko, very delicious uh, fish. Oh, really? Hey, William, do you know Takachico? Yes. Really? Yeah, yes, I, used to go, I used to go fishing, actually. I remember going to, going to go, I remember going fishing at uh, Lempa. Lempa. Yeah, yeah, I remember going to San Isidro fishing. Yes, it is good to fishing. Yeah, that's what William says. He loves fishing. What the, guys, best fish. the best fish. The best fish. It's good. It's good. Thank you, William, and welcome to the class. Thank you. Okay, guys. If for the new ones, uh, for Nathanael and Lucero, uh, usually on Fridays we take a long time on the speaking because we, uh, we, I always plan like a, an hour just of having conversations. Okay, so. Don't worry, this is actually part of the class. This is the day. And also on Mondays, we take a longer part for having conversations, usually uh, asking how was the weekend. And I am evaluating, I am giving some pointers on vocabulary, and I'm also evaluating pronunciation. And well, the, 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 the ones who have been with me for longer have noticed that now I'm asking you the questions like faster, and I'm speaking quite fast right now. I mean, I'm speaking faster than I used to. And that's because uh, that's the way it goes. I mean, this is intermediate. So let's see. I just want to apologize, guys, because the first one of the activities that was supposed to go for today, we are not going to do it because I don't have in this computer the, 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 the text that I send you. But I, we are going to take it, to retake it on Monday, OK? The, do you remember the text that I sent you and that I asked you to, to look for the vocabulary that I'm sure everybody did, right? We are going to do it on Monday, that activity, okay? But we have many different activities. Okay, and let's see. One of the activities that we have programmed for today, okay, uh, is still talking about product development, okay? We're going to check out the steps, the steps for, uh, uh, the step for product development, okay? And you are going to number those steps. How are we going to do it? Easy. We're going to have a conversation and we got here in the manual, we have product development, building vocabulary. How does a new product develop? Number the steps in order from one to eight, then compare with a partner, okay? What are you going to do to order those steps? And I will give you guys, uh, I will give you four minutes for you to do the exercise, okay? You're going to be working in groups of three members to do this exercise. Okay, let me just check on something.
There we go. Okay, groups are created. Please, let's jump in. Let's see, let's go check on the groups. Okay. Sorry. Uh, I, Do you I, agree? For me, it's a confusing idea screening and idea generation. I don't know what is the difference. Uh, idea What's generation? the difference on? Idea, idea screening and idea uh, generation. Okay, idea screening and idea generation. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Idea generation That's... is the first one. Okay, let yes. me see. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Give me a second, guys. I want to help you. Let's see. Idea generation is a lot of idea. Yes, but when we talk about yeah. idea generation, we are talking about the brainstorming. The idea ideas. Uh -huh. the idea screening selection. Uh -huh. yeah. Because first you got the brainstorm and then from the brainstorm, you choose the ideas that you are going to actually use, right? I mean the idea. You get the idea, Marta? I mean yeah. the idea. Um, okay, in this okay, case Marta, look. is... Okay. Look, uh, the, 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 very, the very first step is uh, the business analysis. Okay. Business step for me is um, after the. Oh, I'm idea sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Idea. Yes, you're right, you're right, you're right. We got first idea generation, then we got idea screening. Ah. Then you got concept. Concept development and testing. Okay, concept development. It is the number three, teacher. The, the order will be idea generation, Yes. Number two, idea screening. Number three, concept development and testing. Teacher, I, I yes. product development. No. 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 Because, analysis. because the analysis is, is after. Business number analysis. Four is it's before. Analysis. It's before. Yes. Yes. Okay. Number four is Teacher. business analysis. Yes, Nicolas. I, idea screening. No, it's similar. Uh, um, uh, uh, idea screening is. Um, uh, sorry, teacher. It's, I. It's selecting the ideas. Mm -hmm. It's selecting the ideas. Actually. Ah, okay, okay. Okay. La lluvia de ideas. No, that's review. brainstorming. This review. is generation. That's yes. Brainstorming review. is UVA. Okay, listen up, Nicholas. Review. Brainstorming is UVA de ideas. Okay? Okay. 
That's brainstorming. Then you got the uh, 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 choose one. Oh, then you got the screening, right? The idea is screening. Mm -hmm. And the idea is screening, when we talk about idea screening, uh, is when you discard the bad ideas. When you select, this is a good idea, this is a bad idea. It's the selection of the good ones and the bad ones. Okay, thank you. In this case, it's not uh, after the idea screening, the, the business analysis. analysis. No, nope. concept development. Analysis. Concept development. Mm -hmm. Yes, concept development and testing. Okay. The situation is this. What is the testing talk, in this step? When we talk what about testing? concept development is when you ask for the customer's opinion. Okay. Okay, first you get your ideas. Then you decide which is a good idea, which is a bad idea. Then you have the concept development and testing. Okay, you have the good ideas. You ask for the customer's opinion. Okay. And then, and then you do the business analysis. What is the business analysis? Is when you make the plan. Okay. You make the plan to see to make sure about the acceptance of the product. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, guys. I know that this is marketing and marketing is kind of complex sometimes, right? And then test marketing. I don't know. I'll go, I'll go, oh, I'll go. I've been, me, I've been for, for too long here. Yeah. Okay, yes, okay. I think the same. So if okay, this is tell the... me what you got, guys. We what are is the order you got? We are Number in the... one? Idea, Idea generation. Idea generation, perfect. Number two? Yeah, screening. Okay. Idea screening, excellent. Number three? Business analysis. Ooh, that's four. Mm -hmm. Concept development. Exactly, that's number two. Okay, if that's number three, number four could be business analysis. Yes. Okay. We are yeah. in the And number Product. five? Product development. Excellent. Product. Number five, product development. Number six? Uh, I think it's testing marketing. Excellent. Okay. Seven. Commercialization. Wow, guys, you are so good at this. You are pretty good. Actually, believe me, you are of the best groups at this. Wow, I'm gone. You don't need me here. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. Okay, guys, what you got? Hi. Right. Sorry, and the first one for us is idea generation. Yes. And number two, idea screening. Yes. Number three, business analysis. Uh, uh, concept. Okay, concept. And then number four will be? Uh, business analysis. Yes. Five. Uh, test marketing. Uh, uh, Product development. Yes. Okay. Uh, number six, uh, testing marketing. Uh -huh. Seven, launch and eight, commercialization. Come on, you got them all like this. Switch <laughs> seven and eight. <laughs> 
No It's somos more, de a more continuous teacher. Uh, the, the same mistake all the time. We switch. <laughs> yeah, that's weird, actually. It must be Janita's fault. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, you, know, like you know, Roxana, Janita and me, we've been talking all day about things about you. Seriously? <laughs> yeah, but Why? that's a conversation for another time. Bye. Produce the first step is idea generation. The second step is idea screening. And third step, I I don't remember the is concept. a concept development and testing. Uh -huh. Yes. Four. Fourth step is product development. Ah, uh, business. Sorry, four is business analyze, analysis. Analysis, yes. Business, four. Then is product development. Yes. Uh, after that is test marketing. Excellent. Test marketing. Then is commercialization. And the last step is long, no. Then yes. is launch. No, the no, last no, no, step no, no. Is... The last is launch. The last is launch. Okay. Yep. And the last. Okay, guys, what you got? <clears throat> Tell me the order. <laughs> we, we have a different, a, a different model. This is not us. No, not the okay. same. Let me see. Number one, what you got? Idea generation. Excellent. Number two. Idea uh, screen. Excellent. Idea screen, Jose and me, but Lucero. Uh, Number two uh, is idea screening. Okay, thank you. Number three. Uh, um, to me, product development, but. But they, but they think different ways. It's concept. Number three is concept, concept development. development. Okay. Four. Four. Four development. Business. Ah, business. Okay. Business analysis. Okay, guys. I'm sorry, but we go back to the main room. Let's see, almost everybody's coming back. Okay, let's see, I need to get the attendance. Ambarelli Alfaro Gomez? Present. Thank you. Claudia Lizette Ramos Barrientos? Present, teacher. Daniel Eduardo Segura Valencia. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Present teacher. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Present teacher. José Ernesto Osorio Morán. Present teacher. Lucero Abigail Godínez López. Present. Eh, María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. 
Marta Ana Belinda Morales de Portillo. Gracias, teacher. Natanael Ayala Arizondo. Present teacher. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Present. Oscar Ricardo Alvarenga Rodríguez. Roxana Iveda Asensio de Mejía. Present. Silvia Elizabeth Avendaño Pineda. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present teacher. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present teacher. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Uh, William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. Present teacher. Chanira Elizabeth Asensio García. Present teacher. Okay, guys. Okay, let's see. It was a very, very interesting exercise. But let's see. Uh, Sylvia, you are going to tell us the order, the correct order. So you guys got it at the first try. Okay. Um, step number one, idea generation. Uh, number two, idea screening. Uh, step three, concept development and testing. I'm sorry. Yes. Oh yes, concept development and testing. Um, number four, business analysis. Six, testing. Test number marketing. five. I'm sorry, number five, product development. Number six, test marketing. Number seven, commercialization. And number eight, launch. Okay, excellent. Let's see, Rosales Williams, Sylvia and Walter were the first group who got it right. And some other groups got it also right, the order. But they were the fastest. Okay, guys, let's see, next exercise. Those today we gotta do a lot. Okay. Let me share with you your next exercise. Here we go. Okay. We're again in the manual, but now we are in page number 11. You have to match the name of the steps in the process of developing a new product to their corresponding definition. You got again business analysis, test marketing, idea generation, launch, product development, concept development and testing, commercialization, and idea screening. Now we have to know which is business analysis, which is test marketing. And we have on our side, you have to ask for the customer's opinion. In this stage, research has to be conducted in order to be sure that the product will be accepted. Once the product has been approved, it will be taken to be massively reproduced. It presents the marginal product to be, to be appreciated as a whole by the potential customer. This step guarantees that failing ideas be discarded immediately. A carefully designed plan is important to make sure about the acceptance of the product. Brainstorming. Once the idea has been completed, the product must be taken to a location where customers can get it. Okay, guys. What are you going to do? The matching. How are you going to work? Again, the same groups, okay? And let me share the image with you. So everybody have it like ready. You don't have your manual handy. There we go. I send it to the group and I will send you to work in the groups right now. You are going to have again, five minutes for this activity. Let's do it, please.
Okay, guys, give me a second. Okay, my friends. Okay. Uh, we need much in the number. Uh, yeah, we need much. Uh, in order or you prefer a specific number? Uh, we begin for the for the easy brainstorming. <laughs> <laughs> yes, is in easy number three. Three. It's number yeah. three. Number three. Yeah. The other um, easy is the six. Number six. And development is you have to ask for the customer opinion. Uh, you have to ask for the customer opinion. Concept, concept development and testing. Yeah, I think. Uh, other easy is this step. Warrant is that falling, falling ideas be discarded immediately. Which one is that? Yes, idea screening. Idea screening. Yeah, yeah. idea screening. This is the guarantee is that failing ideas be discarded immediately. Yes, you are right. Okay. okay. Oh, by the way, Fernando. No. Can you stay tonight trouble? with me? Of course, teacher. No, no, no. It was okay, Martha. It's ideas, not once ideas the has been approved. approved. Oh, oh, because that's commercialization. Once the product has been approved, it will be taken to the massive report. That's report. that's commercialization, Marta. Okay. Commercialization. Yes. Yeah. Once the idea has been completed, the product must be taken to a location where customers can get it. That's when you send the product to the to the stores to the supermarkets the customer can get it this is launch what launch, launch. It, it's present the model product to be appropriate it present the model product to be appreciated as a whole by the potential customer launch this Yes, it presents the model product to be appreciated as a whole by the potential customer. You are right, Martha. That's launch. Okay. So, Fernando, remember, you stay tonight with me after the class, okay? Okay, teacher. Perfect. Thank you. Okay. Uh, in this stage, research has to be conducted in order to be sure that the product will be accepted. Is test marketing? Yes. Test marketing. Yes. Mm. With this step, the this step warranty the fail, filing idea be discarded immediately. 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 This is a idea screening number eight. Uh, a little bit complex, right? Yeah. <laughs> yes. You say. Yeah, yes. Yes. Yeah. I, I need traduce. Traduce. Uh, Traduce. No, no, no translation. No translation. No translation. Analysis. Analysis. Uh, very, it's very difficult. Okay, yeah. look, look, what you got to do actually is focus on keywords. Okay, a carefully designed plan is business analysis. Yes, it's cool. It's okay. It's okay for me. Which one? Uh, a careful design plan, yes. Uh, business yes. analysis. Business analysis. Launch. Okay. Launch. Uh, 
And once the idea has been completed, is launch. No, I know launch is. Is presenting the customer. And what is, which is product development? Uh huh. Oh, we have problem, teacher. I can hear very well. I oh. have problem with the with my internet. Hola. Hello, Roxana. Can you hear me? I guess it's. Okay, Roxana, I will yeah, recommend you to. Okay, if you continue getting that problem, uh, turn off your camera for a little while. I... Okay. And let me know if that helps because the camera, you know. Hola. It... Yes, hello. Can you hear me now? Mm, yes, but it's not okay because it's, se escucha cortado siempre. That's weird because I hear you perfectly. It must be Janita's fault. Mm. I'll be back in a second, guys. Hello, hello, guys. You finish, Amber? Yes. yes. Okay, okay, excellent. We'll see, we'll see how did it go. So, Wilfredo, you're from Takachico, right? Yes. Man, you just brought back some memories. It was a long while ago, hace tanto tiempo. I have um, a lot of memories. 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 Yeah, but last last time I was there was 2004. Really? Yes. Yes, I, I mean, it was fun. Actually, I was I was living with some friends over there. It was a very nice uh, experience. I, I have a house teacher near to Takachico in Resbaladero. We have really? a, yes. Uh, how do you say, teacher? It is uh, like a um, camp houses. Country house. Camp. Country, Country house. house. Yeah. Yes. That's cool. It is. It is near to Tocachico. Yeah, Resbaladero is pretty close. Yes. Yes. So yeah. you live in Tacachico, Wilfredo? I grew up in Resbaladero, near to Tacachico. Ah. Yeah, a few kilometers from. Yes. Mm. And last yeah. Sunday, last Sunday I went to play soccer to Resbaladero. And this Sunday I'm going to I I, I go I hope in God. I am going to go with my son to play um, La Colonia in La Planta. No, oh, really? I, I, I don't know, uh, but I, in, in Takachico, uh, he, she, 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 she live, she live, teacher? She live, or I Okay, let's see, everybody's coming back.
Okay, let's see. Everybody's here. Perfect. Excellent, excellent. Let's see how did it go. Let me share, guys, the screen. Sorry, let's see, we are right here. Okay, let's see. Uh, let's see, business analysis. What is business analysis, Fernando? Uh, Carefully designed plan is important to make sure about the uh, the acceptance, acceptance of the product. Perfect. Thank you very much. Let's see. Let's see. Just a second. Just a second, guys. Let's see. Nathanael, tell me, what do you think is test marketing? Test ma marketing is you how to ask to the customer opinion. Mm -hmm. Let's see, what do you think about it? Thank you very much, Nathanael. What do you think about it? Sylvia, what is test marketing? I think test marketing is in this stage, research has to be conducted in order to be sure that the product will be accepted. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. In this stage, research has to be conducted in order to be sure that the product will be accepted. That's correct. Now, let's see, let's see. Roxana, tell me what is idea generation? Sana. Hi, I'm sorry, my internet freezing on my computer. Uh, I think that uh, uh, this this step guarantees the filing ideas be discarded immediately. Okay. Well, 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 let's see. What do you think about it? Amber, what is idea generation for you? Thank you, Roxana. Brainstorming. Perfect, thank you very much. Brainstorming, excellent. Now let's see, let's see. Number four, launch. Janita, tell me what is launch for you? I'm sorry, teacher. I I not hear you. Okay, can you repeat me? Number Please. four, launch. Uh, number three. Once the product has been approved, approved, and will be taken to be massively reproduced. Massive, well, massively actually, reproduced. Actually, launch is this one. Look, it presents the model product to be appreciated as a whole by the potential customer. Thank you, Shanira. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Lucero, number five, product development. Okay. Uh, to me, I think the answer to product development is when the product has been approved, it will be taken to be massively reproduced. Okay, once the product has been approved, it will be taken to be massively reproduced. Number five. Perfect, Lucero. Excellent. Let's see, number six, concept development and testing. Nicolás. What you got? Well, I think uh, the concept development and testing is you have to ask 
for the customer's opinion. Opinion. Perfect, Nicolas. Excellent. Well done. Now, let's see, let's see, let's see. Walter, number seven, tell me commercialization. What is commercialization for you? Okay, once the idea has been completed, the product must be taken to a location where customers can get it. Perfect, Walter. That's exactly number seven. And number eight, idea screening is this step guarantees that failing ideas be discarded immediately. Okay, guys, let me just get you the picture of the exercise. So you got it. Everybody's got it like salt over there. Perfect. Well done. Now, let's see. Interesting activity, no? We're going to use those concepts for later on the class. But before we move on, uh, I would like you to explain a little bit of grammar because the activity is from the platform for today, today's class as the section, uh, the second activity is that you got the homework in the platform. It's related actually to, give me a second, present perfect. And I would like to make a review about present perfect. Let's first let's remember when we talk about present perfect, we I was explaining you the other day that present perfect expresses an idea that started in the past and it's not finished, it continues. Okay. Let me explain it to you in a different way. Okay, let's see, let's see. Like this. Okay. Present perfect expresses an idea that goes like this. Okay. Let's see. The idea. Let's see, first of all, let's remember we are talking about present perfect okay if we got that this point right here is the past and we got like the present is right here Okay, let's see. We got present perfect, we got the past, we got the present. Now let's see. And this is the past. Here is the present. And the present perfect expresses something that continues that start in the past and continues, okay? And continues to the future, you see? It goes. So when we talk about present perfect, we are talking about an action that started in the past and continues until the present, okay? Let's remember that. It started at a certain time, a certain moment in the past, and it continues until the future. We are talking about an action that is not finished yet. Okay. It can that action can have started any moment in the past or at a specific moment, but it's not finished. Like I used to say the example, I have taught English for more than 20 years. And I will continue teaching English. Like, Fernando, tell me, how long have you worked for your company? I have worked 
three years. I have worked, I have worked for the company for three years. For three years, right. Okay, perfect. Let's see, Roxana, how long have you been married? I have been married for, I don't know, five years. I don't know, that's not an answer. Come on, Roxana, <laughs> you're in trouble with your husband. Thank you. <laughs> Let's see, Jose Osorio, how long have you been, have you worked for your company? I have been working for uh, there uh, since I was 20 years. And oh. now I, I have 34 years. I am, I am. I am, I am 34 years old. Wow, 14 years in the company. That's a long while. That's a long time. Thank you very much, guys. Okay, let's go back to the, to the board. Now, let's see. Something very important that we need to remember is this. Remember the structure. We have the structure for the affirmative is subject. Then we got the auxiliary. What, which is the auxiliary for the present perfect? In this case, it can either be have or has. Okay. Then we have the verb, the main verb, but this verb is in past participle. And then we have the complement, okay? That's the basic structure. What are we talking about when we say the basic structure? Very simple. We say it like this. We say, okay, we have the subject. In this case, is uh, I. I have worked for, I have worked in my case, I told you I have worked as a teacher for 20 years. That's in my personal case, I have worked as a teacher for 20 years. Okay, now let's see how does it go. The subject, I. The auxiliary, have. The, best, the verb in past participle, work. And then we have the complement, right? The complement is all this. But if you notice, the action started 20 years ago and still continues. That's for the affirmative. For the negative, what do we do? Oh, we just get not here. I have not. That's simple. Remember, this is just a review because that's something that you have already, you have seen already, right? So it's not like it's something new for us. But let me go with you. Uh, to another explanation that we have in your manuals. In your manuals, you have an explanation about present perfect in page number 13. You can check it out in your manuals in page number 13, okay? And let me share with you so we can check it out. It's right here. Okay, how to use present Perfect. It says here that it expresses actions that were started sometime in the past at no specific moment. The actions may or may not continue in the present. Use the helping verb have plus the past participle form of the verb that expresses the action. And look, we have questions here. 
have you lost your mind? If you notice the structure here is the auxiliary, then the subject, then we got the verb in past participle, the complement and the question mark. And we got the short answer. In this case, we got short answers because we are talking about yes, no questions with present perfect. Have you lost your mind? Yes, I have. No, I haven't. Do you understand this expression? Have you lost your mind? That expression is... La yeah, estás loco. As simple as that. Perdiste la cabeza, estás loco. That's the way we say it, no? Have you lost your mind? Excellent, Jenny. And the short answer, remember, we in Spanish here, we just say yes or no, but remember that in English, short answers are not that short. They take a little bit longer. And that's when we are using formal English because in informal English, you can either say just yes or no. Have you lost your mind? Yes. Yeah, sure. Or simply not. But in formal English, you say, yes, I have, or no, I have it. In this case, we have the explanation here using formal English. Look at the next question. Have they always sold everything they offer? Yes, they have. No, they haven't. Or yes, they have sold everything they offer. No, they haven't sold everything they offer. Look at the next example. Has Alejandro created a new product line? Yes, he has. No, he hasn't. Or yes, he has created a new product line or no, he hasn't created a new product line. So as you can see here, we got short answers and we also got long answers, but still we are talking about yes, no question. Why? Because remember that we can also have information questions like the one that I asked Jose Osorio. I asked him, hey, Mr. How long have you worked for your company? And he told me, oh, I have worked for the company since I was 20 years old, okay? So in that case, I was asking for a specific information. Like I asked Claudia, Claudia, uh, tell me, how long have you taught math? Claudia. I have six taught, years. I have taught math. Uh, I have taught, taught math six Four, years. Four, six years. Four. Four, six years. When we say the time, when we say the, the, the amount of time, we use four. When we use the specific moment, as Jose did it, we use since, okay? Like Sylvia, Sylvia, tell me, how long have you worked as a receptionist? I have worked as a receptionist for uh, three years. Okay, thank you. Yeah. So if you see, it's quite, quite simple. Okay, guys. Now, uh, we got a homework for you guys. I need you to start thinking about a product that you want to create. And I need you to do at least for Monday, I need you to do, I'll tell you which steps. Hold on just a second. Teacher, can you, can you repeat, please? Okay. The idea is this. I need you to do, for Monday, the idea generation and the idea screening of a new product. All of you, 
Do you remember that yesterday I told you that you were going to create a product? We are going to be doing it together, okay? Here in the class. So for Monday, what I need you to do is the idea generation and idea screening. Bring that done, okay? So you get the idea and you get all the idea and start checking out which are correct, which are fine, which are you could develop and which you could not, okay? I need all of you to bring it because when we start the class, I will get you in groups. You are going to share that information. And as a group, you are going to choose one product, okay? One of the products. So you're going to be working in groups of two or three members. So for Monday, idea generation and idea screening of one product, okay? Any product you choose. Is it clear now? We are going to do just the first two steps. So it would be like this. Uh, Let's see, I want to create a new product. And I say, okay, I want to create a, a new cell phone case, perhaps a new cell phone case, or I need to create, uh, I will create a, a new eraser, or I will create a new, a new presentation for a, ball, a ballpoint pen, then I will do the idea screening. Okay, let's see. Uh, cellular cases, man, there are too many. I mean, you go to the, to, the, to the mall and you find people selling big quantities of that. So it's not a good product, it's card. Then I will decide if if it's better for me to, to work with erasers or with pens, okay? That's idea screening. I am discarding the bad ones, choosing the good ones. Do you understand the activity? Yes, teacher. Perfect, thank you very much. Remember, we're going to discuss working as a group because working as a group, you are going to choose one group and you are going to do, again, the same. You are going to do the brainstorm about how you are going to present that product. And you are going to discard ideas. This idea is acceptable. This is not. Okay. We're going to be, I'm going to be helping you and giving you the instructions step by step. So right now, I need you just to think about three or four products and choose one for Monday. That's the idea. And if you do that, you have done the first two steps. Brainstorm, get you choose four or five products, then idea screening. Okay, this is not acceptable. This is not good. This is too complex to present. This is the one that I want to present. That was the idea screening, okay? So let's see. If you got any questions, you can text me, okay? Don't worry. Now, let's do the next exercise for us. Let me see just a second. Okay. Just a second, guys. I need to get um, this is this need to go like this. Let me share, let me share with you. We're going to continue working in the manual. And we got here, complete the statements below using the words in parentheses. Then you have to compare your answers with a partner. Okay, a lot of companies, you're going to tell me how do we place these two verbs? Have and grow here. Have, attract, and second one. 
I'll give you a few seconds. I'll give you one minute for you to check them out, the verbs, and then I'm going to start asking you, okay? Okay, let's see, let's see who's going to be first. Let me put this here. Let's see, Ambar, hello, Ambar. Hello. How do you feel? you feel better? Can you help me, number one? Yes, uh, a lot of company have grew okay. because because of well thought new product lines. Okay, let's see. A lot of companies have, look, grown. Grown, oh, okay. Have grown because of well thought new product lines. Perfect number, thank you very much. Now let's see, let's see, let's see who's gonna help me with next one. William, next one is yours, number two. Yes, teacher. Number new two. Members, new members of a product line uh, they attract the new market segment. Okay, let's see. We say here that new members of a product line have attracted new market segments. Thank you very much, mister. Let's see, let's see. Number four goes to Walter. Number three, I'm sorry. Walter. Hello, hello, teacher. Uh, we have decided to expand the old product. Okay, thank you. We have, we have, oops, my bad. We have decided to expand on our new product. We have decided to expand on our new product. Next one, let's see. Next one goes to Lucero, number four. Okay, some companies haven't, haven't succeed, succeeded when launching succeeded. a new product. Succeeded, succeeded. Succeeded. Succeed. Mm -hmm. succeed. Some company haven't succeeded when launching a new product because of their lack of knowledge about the target audience. Audience, okay. So she says that some companies, oops, some companies, uh, sorry, have not oops. My bad, succeeded. Some companies have not succeeded or haven't succeeded when launching a new product because of their lack of knowledge about the target audience. Perfect. Marta, number five. Have you ever, have you ever found any highly recognized, I, I don't say, recognize product lines. Okay, so you are telling me that it goes like this. Have you um, ever both, 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 any, both. both any highly recognized product lines? Perfect, Marta. Mm -hmm. 
Excellent. And now let's see, let's see, let's see. Who's gonna go to with the last one? Susana. Answer. Have, have you company? Okay, remember that your company is one. Third person has. Has your uh, company? Has. Ah, sí, excuse me. Has your company uh, designer? Okay. Designer? Mm -hmm. Has your, your company? Perfect. Has your company designed design, any new product or service recently? Recently. Mm -hmm. Recently. Recently. Yes. So the, the sentence goes like this. A lot of companies have grown because of well-thought new product lines. New members of a product line have attracted new market segments. We have decided to expand on our product. Some companies have not succeeded when launching a new product because of their lack of knowledge about the target audience. Have you ever bought any highly recognized product lines? Has your company designed any new product or service recently? Okay, guys. Wow, very interesting. Let's see, let me get the attendance, please. I need to get the final attendance. Okay, Ambarelli Alfaro Gomez. Present. Claudia Elisa Ramos Barrientos. Present, teacher. Daniel Eduardo Segueda Valencia. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Present. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. José Ernesto Osorio Morán. Thank you, Francisco. Present teacher. Thank you. Lucero Abigail Godínez López. Present. Thank you. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Marta Navelinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Natanael Ayala Aristondo. Present teacher. Nicolás Cecilio Méndez Granados. Present. Oscar Ricardo Alvarenga Rodríguez. Roxana Ibeta Asensio de Mejía. Present. Silvia Elizabeth Avendaño Pineda. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present teacher. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present teacher. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. Present teacher. And Janira Elizabeth Asensio Garcia. Present teacher. Thank you very much. Who raised your hand? Can I levant la mano? Okay. Thank you very much. No problem, Daniel. Got you. Thank you very much, guys. Have a good night. I hope to see you Monday. Bye-bye. Bye. Very -bye. Bye. Bye. good night. Bye. Good night. Bye-bye. Hi, teacher. Hello, mister. Hello. Let me just do a little something here. How are you? Um, I'm I'm fine, teacher. I'm, I'm 
a little tighter, but I'm fine. Okay, okay. And tell me, how do you like the activities today? Uh, uh, very complicated because the knowledge about marketing for me is it's, it's complicated. Yeah, it's new vocabulary, right? Uh, right, a new vocabulary. But yeah, and and we are going. I mean, we have increased our pace. We are going faster. Yes, yes, I noticed that. The activities are going faster. I mean, it's shorter time. We are doing more activities in the class, and the the the, the speed of the speaking is increasing which actually is good for you guys, because I mean, that's what you really need, no? Fluency. Yeah, it is, it's, it's good for, for us. And I don't know, I, I, I feel, <laughs> sometimes I feel stuck in the, in, in, the, in the moment, in the level. And yeah, it's understandable. Remember that, I mean, from basic to intermediate one, we took it like slow. We took it like slow, like still like um, no much problem. But if you notice the, the, the group is getting more compact and that's allowing us to, to increase the pace, to get faster. And of course, don't worry, it's not you. I know that a lot of your classmates are like this, are like, man, I don't understand everything. But the idea is that uh, I need to push you because otherwise you'll get too comfortable. I mean, I need to take you out of that. I need to move you to, to something different. And the manual is asking us for a lot. It's very demanding. Because for Monday, the, the grammar aspect that we are going to analyze, it's very interesting. Yeah. And it's going to make, it's going to make, uh, I mean, in your case, due to your level of vocabulary, it's going to make some things like, you're going to say like, oh man, it's so easy to, to express this type of ideas. You will see it. And that's the important part that you get like, uh, that you get like the, 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 any new vocabulary and expressions, because those expressions, in this case, we are going to use albers. And albers to express times like before, after, okay? And those okay. little, we saw them as connectors. Do you remember that we saw them as connectors? As connector and or yeah exactly if exactly and now we are going to work with them but we are going to make to get them into a different context and actually when you get vocabulary when you get perhaps the same vocabulary the same grammar point but in a different context it helps you to understand it better and to apply it even better so that's the idea that perhaps i mean we are going to review some of grammar aspects that you already know, but we are making it bigger in complexity and in vocabulary. I, I understand, teacher. But okay, we, we, sometimes we it's frustrating. For... <laughs> I know. I know that sometimes it can be frustrating, right? Yeah, sometimes it's frustrating, but. Because I, I I don't understand the the the, the entire sentence, so I don't know. But well, for that remember video. remember Fernando, uh, you can stop me anytime. You can raise your hand. You can open your microphone and tell me, "Hey teacher, please, I didn't get you. I don't get the idea. I don't understand it." And I mean. It's good when you do it because sometimes it could be that it's not just you, perhaps more of your classmates don't understand it and they stay quiet. But if you do it, you are not just helping yourself, you are helping the others. And you open, I mean, that also helped me to perhaps explain in a different way and you get more vocabulary, you get a better explanation and you understand the aspect or the word 
or the sentence yeah, that you didn't quite catch. So stop me anytime. It doesn't matter that we're in an intermediate. I mean, sometimes it's going to be funny. You are going to forget the very basics. <laughs> and that's, that's normal. Idea. That's normal. Sometimes we forget the very basic words or very basic structure. And that's quite normal because yeah, yeah, we get yeah. to focus on the complex and sometimes well in your area I, I am sure that that has happened to you that sometimes you are to focus on on trying to solve the complex things that sometimes the solution is the easy one yeah it's it's common <laughs> yeah that happens and in this in language it happens also i mean sometimes it's not what is giving you problem to understand the whole idea is not the, the the heavy grammar aspect sometimes it's just one word and when you get that word you understand everything yeah. um, so yeah. the best advice that i can give you for this for specifically for this course is this any doubt any question don't hesitate ask it okay remember as you just said that's why we're here you are learning you need it, ask for it. I will help you. That's the idea. I'm here to help you. Okay, teacher. Teacher, don't don't hesitate. Is, uh, no, no do they? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. No. That's... Uh, is to hesitate is to be like when you are like uh, when you are like uh, where you are going to do something and you get like you don't quite decide to jump to do it. No, okay. That's why I tell you, oh, don't hesitate. Okay. Yeah, I, I write the, my, my vocabulary for, for practicing after the class or, or the next days because sometimes I, I, I forget it. And when I, I, when I want to use it, I don't remember. And after, the, 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 after you and me finish the, the conversation, I remember the, the phrase. <laughs> Yeah, because I mean, uh, look, we are going to use something next class. We are going to use a, a concept that is very interesting is SWOT, S W O T. What? Yep, that's a concept. A what concept is... that we use to solve problems and we use it in Spanish a lot. Actually, it was on fashion a few years ago. Estuvo de moda hace unos años. What? Uh, yeah. I ¿Foda? Know. Oh, foda, yeah. That's, that's S-W-O-T. Strength, weakness, you see? Opportunities, threats. Okay. And, and we are going to work with that. Ah, okay. Interesting. Um, yeah. Peter, I, I have a... a a suggestion for the class? Yes, tell me. Uh, the, the, the other time uh, we do an uh, exercise with, with time, with one minute. Do you remember? Yeah. Yeah, the, this, this style of exercise is, is for me, is, I don't know, it's very... Um, me enseña mejor? Yeah, of course. I'm going to take it into an account. Don't worry. So yeah, we're yeah. going to go like, like faster, like Set the time, one minute, let's do it. Yeah, we did it one, one time and, and this kind of exercise for, for me was, was, was good. Yeah, don't worry, don't worry. Actually, we're going to have it this, let's see, perhaps uh, Tuesday and Wednesday, we're going to have vocabulary practice. In that section, we will have time to make deep, many short activities. And short activities are like that. I mean, we get with time, short time, we jump to another activity. Uh, I give you one, two minutes and you have to produce, give me something. And that's going to help you a lot because I mean, it activates your mind. Yes. And, yeah. and I, I, I try to understand my, my partner when, when the time, when, it, when is the turn. And yeah. If for a minute, I, I, I have to- You pay more attention. Yeah, I, I pay more attention because it, the pain is, is fast and, and yeah, it, it's, it it's different when 
it's, it's different when you talk with them uh, for a long time. So, and I don't, I don't know, in, in, in a part of the conversation, I, I lost the, the focus. Yeah, that happens, that happens. I'll take it into an account, don't worry. We will work on it. Hey, thank Fernando, you. thank you very much. We okay, will see, see you, you actually, we will have another session with you almost before the end of the course. Okay, you have sure. You have two sessions program. Okay, teacher, good for me. Yeah, sure. <laughs> it was a pleasure. Have a good night, mister. Have a good night, teacher. <laughs>